Today we're talking about my top five plugins from MotionVFX, which is one of my favorite companies in the world. They do incredible plugins that help me every single day when I'm editing. As a content creator, as a YouTuber, filmmaker, these come in really, really handy. They are of the uttermost quality and they have a slight finesse and class that makes your videos just shine and look like they're from feature films. You know, it, it, it just looks really, really incredible. The first one I use is M Review, and this is a great plugin. Let me show you how it works. Right, these plugins are really easy to use. I add zooms, I add text, I add pointers. You can change where the zoom is gonna be. Everything is very intuitive, very simple. You can change literally every single piece of text, icons, and this is what it looks like. Presenting the Armor Grom 118th. Big wheels, hard body, and a super strong front bumper. 74% softer suspension and 27% thicker wheels. And for $130, this thing is so fast, it'll knock your socks off. So as you can see, it's got a lot of features. It looks really great. The next one I use is M Title M Cinematic 2. I use number one as well, but the two is the one I've been using recently and it looks really, really nice on drone shots, on basically on anything. It gives your film that kind of cinematic look, you know? cinematic look it does it, it just adds that extra level to your video let's check it out when it comes to the m title plugins i am a huge fan and you can literally change every single part of the title use your own fonts change the font size change where the font is the color when it fades in when it fades out and you have a ton of ready animations to choose from meaning that it's almost never ending. They're all very nice, very classy, and they look like something right out of Hollywood. Take a week off and fly over to the Baltic Sea. It's a beautiful place. In fact, right here, it's called Hell. See, that looks really nice. Now, I also use M Kinetic 2, which is a really nice plugin. It's basically text that carries on writing as you're speaking or, you know, goes up and it, it does a whole load of different things. It's got some glow text. It's got, it's got nice, really nice text that you can all change and adjust to your liking. And I use it in just about every single video I do here on YouTube. Check it out. I've got to say, Kinetic 2 is no doubt one of the titles I use the most. You can really alter every single little detail from changing font size to when it appears to the glows. Every single part of the Kinetic 2 titles is different. So they communicate to your audience in a different way. They appear and disappear in a different way, allowing you to very easily describe and show visually what you're trying to communicate. I've been here six times and every time I leave I want to come straight on back. Do not drink the water. Don't even get in it. The next one is M Roto AI which is really cool and it is part of the subscription service from MotionVFX which you can pick up and pay for monthly instead of paying for a whole load of plugins which would cost you thousands and millions and billions of dollars. It's really cool, check out what it can do. First, I'm gonna use MLUT to color grade my footage with my own LUT. Let's get MROTO AI on. Let's scribble over the boat. And if it doesn't get it all, scribble a little bit more, press tracker, and it's basically gonna track what it has selected or what you've selected, scribbling over it. And it's that simple. This is no doubt the biggest time saver I have ever, ever had when it comes to masking. It's absolutely incredible. Now we're gonna copy that layer, select masked video, and you're only gonna be affecting the little bit that you have scribbled over and masked. You know what's funny? I have a pair of shorts that would match that boat very nicely. Mm -hmm. That's pretty impressive. And it saves a lot of time when it comes to masking. It really does. The last one 
is MUTuber free. Now I use MUTuber 1, 2, and 3, and they're all fantastic. In fact, I use MUTuber 2 in every single video I do at the very end with the mouse and the bell. But they're plugins that come in handy if you're a YouTuber, you know? They got loads of different, you know, subscribe, like, follow, and all that stuff. Let's check it out on a shot. MUTuber 1, 2, and 3 are extremely useful and they have a lot of tools for content creators, adding your own social medias, adding your chapters, adding corner screens. It's all so easy using MUTuber. And this is MUTuber free where you can create your own logos. You can create comparison screens. You can add in literally any single logo from social media you want. It is no doubt one of the fastest, simplest ways of creating content with really nice, elegant titles included. Why don't you smash the like button and um, follow me on Instagram whilst you're at it. This is me pointing at a circle and um, these chapters below come in handy. See, that comes in really handy. So right now I'm going to use MUTuber2 at the very end. Remember all links are down below for all different occasions. I will be changing them throughout the year. And um, if you did like my video, give me a like. If you haven't, make sure you subscribe and, you know, ring that bell. And uh, I'm going to catch you on the next one. Thanks, Motion VFX.